news. Let's have some more good news here. At the start of May every year, we all like to take a little time to appreciate nurses across the country for National Nurses Week. And joining me now to talk more about what it means and what it takes to be a good nurse, because it's one of those jobs that certainly a lot of people couldn't do if they tried. I'm happy to have Ka Karen Pagliero. She's the uh, a registered nurse and the director of community and government relations at Hartford Healthcare. And it's my first time getting to meet you. Glad to have you Thank here. Thank you for having me here. Thank my, you. Uh, really, my my pleasure, and we are here to celebrate you and all of your fellow nurses out there. Uh, please tell me, what does it take to be a nurse, and what does it mean to be a nurse? Well, for me, being a nurse means caring. It means caring for people no matter where <laughs> they are, what type of illness they have. Yeah. We care for them from the moment they're born until the time that they die. I mean, it's so amazing to cradle a newborn and yeah. hand it to a mom, oh my or even to hold somebody's hands when they're taking their last breath, and then be able to comfort their family. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's all about caring. It's giving your heart to other people. And uh, what about the mission of the Hartford uh, Healthcare at Home staff? So for us, our staff, we want to provide the best coordinated care that we can across the continuum. In other words, we want to be able to provide great nursing care, hospice care, palliative care, and then we also provide care within the community with blood pressure clinics and blood sugar clinics and cholesterol clinics. Now, you mentioned hospice care. You mentioned palliative care. Yeah. Uh, there's a side to nursing that probably doesn't get uh, as much credit as it should. That's not an easy job all no, the time because sometimes you have to take care of people who can't take care of themselves no. and it, it's not pretty. Sometimes they're not always appreciative of what you do as well. I've heard the stories. What does it take to be a nurse? I think it takes patience, it takes understanding, it takes the willingness to give of yourself and to really just put aside any feelings you might have and do the right thing and do the care. Um, it, it, you never know, like for a home care nurse, you never know when you walk into a home what you're going to find. Yeah. And um, you usually leave there feeling like, wow, I've done something. I've mm -hmm. helped them learn their medication. I've dressed their wound. I've taught them how to care for their wound or taught them how to take care of their diabetes. It's, it's a fabulous feeling. And it's making a difference on the most direct and basic level that you can. There's nothing indirect about it. And that's why we need uh, help from nurses all around for National Nurses Week. Now, also, this is the time when uh, Hartford HealthCare honors nurses with the Nightingale yes, Award. Exactly. I'm guessing after Florence Nightingale. Yeah. It, it is named after Florence <clears throat> Nightingale. Um, this is our 16th year participating in it. We host it. It's going to be actually tomorrow at the Connecticut Convention Center. Wonderful. And what it is, is it's a program to honor the exceptional nurses and the contribution they've made. It doesn't matter whether you're an LPN, an RN, an APRN. It doesn't matter if you work in a hospital or home care or a clinic. It just brings nurses and highlights the wonderful things that they do. And you said it's such a wonderful night just to it be It is. It's spectacular. The nurses love it. We're honoring 82 nurses tomorrow. Wonderful. We have over 560 people coming. It's going to be great. Just great. 82 nurses. And really, they all deserve it. So yes. again, National Nurses Week, if you know one, just give them a little extra thank you. Karen, thank you thank for you. so much. Thank for you so not much. Not just coming here today, but for everything you and nurses all around the world Thank you. Do. I appreciate that. A pleasure thank to you. have you here. Thank you.